All right, we're at episode 15 through 21 of Demon Slayer. That was a lot um, of episodes. Yeah, a lot of episodes, and uh, we're into a nasty little spider web. It was the Mount Natagumo arc. Yep. And I, it was much longer than I thought it was going to be. Um, I expected maybe three or four episodes as your standard story spot. It was just been. a lot of storytelling. It was. There it was it. A, this <sighs> arc, like, there was a lot in Everybody this. was in it. We met so many new characters. Everyone had uh, character progression. And the story building. Zensu, yep. uh, Inosuke, and Tajiro, and Nezuko. And Nezuko, yeah. Um, all had a, a lot of development. And you got... like so, so, this whole section covered the one of the 12 main demons. Right. Lower five, though. And Rui, R R U I. Mm Mm-hmm. Uh, he actually had some character building. You you met him. You learned his entire story and why he was the way he was. Actually, um, one of the best parts about the show in general, just to piggyback on that, is the fact that the demons aren't just bad guys. They're humans. And they right. Have, and it tells their human right. story. So it's like, what you know they have to die. But it's Tanjiro like, can kind of see that, just like back in, like it keeps reminding me of Jujutsu Kaisen and Yuji, that could see the human side of the enemy. But he As, knows what has to be done. Yes, yes, and that's in, important, right? And I do. I think that too. But I think him being able to see that human side actually makes his character a little more deadly. I think because he's still doing it and killing the demon, even though he knows there's that person was in there. Because yeah. as of right now, they don't have the way to save them. You're saying he walks around with a harder task. Most yes. demon slayers kill yep. because they have to kill demons. But Tanjiro and, is like taking on the fact that even though he will do it. He's acknowledging their existence right. as humans, even though they're not any longer. And that's a really good part of his character, yeah. actually. And you see with, like, <clears throat> Tamiyoka, who was the first Demon Slayer we met before Tanjiro was actually trained. Right. You see that once they get higher in their their field, they literally go kill this demon, and that's it. That's yep. all they live by. That's their only rule. Or, like, when their task is given, they see it to the end. But now, with Tamioka seeing Tanjiro and Nezuko being, you know, a, a took pair, a while to even realize it was them actually, which I was a little offended by, and I would yeah. have too. It's only been two years. With Tamioka, he saw something in Nezuko that he's never seen before. I thought he would have realized that a little sooner. But to be fair, he was trying to save her life in that moment and was m- more focused on the girl who, uh, the insect demon slayer that was accompanying him. Which cool sword, neat idea. And she's pretty ruthless. And her personality mixed with, like, her brutality Mm -hmm. is a a cool mix. She's She's not strong enough to cut or kill demons head up, but she poisons them. Yep. Which is a cool concept. Which no one knew you could do of. I mean, you had to cut their head off or see them with those swords. Right, as we saw with... Tanjiro had the issue with Rui. Yep. And cutting off the head. Okay, since you brought it up, we have to talk about the animation in that fight. I mean, it was... And his and not even that. It like, was like the best he of mixed, here. Right. So the whole water technique and everything that Tanjiro uses, the animation is beautiful. Um, oh, and now he can do fire. Right. So now you brought in this beautiful element to mix with each other. And I think that was... And Nesco's demon art ability. Oh, yeah, the blood art, which I yep. still have some questions about. But obviously you see the top 12 ones have blood art too. Right. So she's able to do something that probably only a handful are able to do. She's really strong. And with them combined as like a pair, I think they'll be unstoppable. And I just want to, I know this is going to hurt you. What? Um, I am oh so over Zenitsu. He can just stop. He can just stop being a demon slayer and go home. Oh, no. Just I, go home. No, I actually like the fact he that He has one put... form, pointless. He has to be passed out to do it. Also, real special. Like, only certain things have to happen for him to be relevant. Mm-hmm. Okay, he killed the spider demon. Meanwhile, everybody else is fighting something ten times stronger than that spider, and he's having trouble with it. So if he's unwilling and unable to grow as a character, as a demon slayer, I won't even say character because we have character built from him. Yeah, he had a really good episode. But actually. now that he's there and he's he has such all the stars have to align perfectly for him to be a right functional now. demon slayer. Right now, yeah, he could just go. Yeah, no, I yeah. <laughs> well, you call that right? I definitely disagree with that. And Enosuke, I, I think, is great. I think he's realizing how weak he truly is, which yeah, he I got think his is, ass whipped pretty much every episode. Yeah, and this will be his character development. I think he'll be, you know, <clears throat> yeah, but so he'll Zen learn Su- from this. Zensu is the same thing. We don't need. If him. He, we don't need him. He can learn if <laughs> if Enosuke can learn from it. So can Zensu. So. I think uh, it, he'll be better for it. I think Zensu will learn just like Inosuke did from his failings. He'll learn. Actually, 
Uh, Zensu didn't get his ass whipped. He was poisoned and still killed that spider. Right, and he breathed to and stay then, alive. Yeah, he breathed to stay alive for like two episodes. Okay? <laughs> well, yeah, he but did reality, the hardest thing seconds. of anybody else in this, like, this 15 through 21. <laughs> he had the best feet. He didn't die, and he controlled his breathing for like what? I mean, how many hours I'd was say it? Say a couple, because it was all one night. Yeah, it was one night, but how many? It was a couple hours, probably. Yeah, he I would was say trying a few not to hours. Die. Yeah, because yeah. the sun came up later on that morning. Completely disagree with so, you on that. But one. I don't know. Maybe. But they good. Have, how many episodes they got left? Five to convince me yeah. that Zenitu deserves a place on this squad. Well, if he didn't, if he didn't earn it to you in that fight, he's not going. to. Okay, then I don't. Yeah. I'm good where he lies in my. He's book. good with me though. You know, he's good with me. It this was the this chunk of chunk of episodes showed the weakness of the lower level demon slayers, the strength of the top level demon slayers. Swords broke left and right. There was demons that couldn't be cut. Through. I guess they have to have new like, swords cut. Yeah, uh, I, which I'm excited for. And fingers crossed that it's going to be the red one that they spoke about in the beginning, mm. and that's what I'm super excited about because okay, okay. first roll. Black sword. Done. Broken. Now, since he has his fire abilities, he has his water abilities, let's do something that kind of, like, if he keeps his water techniques, the f sword will have the fire isn't it, techniques. Isn't it pure destiny what color that is? I thought they That's mentioned right. the fact that... Yeah, but now that he has this, he didn't have this before. This fire dancing so from his family. A difference? Yeah, because they really did a lot on the family part of this whole series, too. Mm -hmm. Like, you know... Rui just wanted a family. He was creating his own. Well, he murdered his own. They were that was to a kill really, him. That was a thought. really crazy story. Yeah, and like, then you have Tanjiro who <clears throat> went back to his childhood and his father mm -hmm. to find that fire dance. Be like right before he died. His, yeah, what kept his father, you know, dancing in his weak, frail moments and stuff like that. It was that inner strength from this dance that, you know, I think is going to be. Part and of it. in that moment, um, what I was drawn to was the fact that um, they had a pretty good uh, I don't know if this is common knowledge about what a lot of people think or not but when he was about to die uh, and you go through your memories you know oh, it's a that common was saying right, thing, right yeah. before you die you you know you have your life flash before your eyes and you have your life play back in an instant and it was a reference that that was just your body in a split second trying to find a single memory that could stop what's about to happen to happen. And I thought that was such a cool the way to think about that. survival for your brain. Yeah, like, I, just, I just thought that was a cool Keep you moment. alive, think of something you remember. And hopefully it's something good. If not, you know, you're just going to But anyway, I just thought that yeah. was a really good point. So this was a lengthy chunk of episodes. And, you know, at the end, the last episode is with the crow. Our personal annoying crow didn't show up. But two others did. To tell the Demon Slayer, the uh, Tamioka and Butterfly, to capture... No, I would say capture, but it seems not that harsh. But to capture Tanjiro and Nezuko. Yep. And they found uh, Inosuke hanging around, li lifeless, He's made enough noise now to where now like the higher-ups in the Demon Slayer world want to know exactly what Nezuko is. Because okay. it's like, right. this guy's doing yeah. a lot of good yep. shit, and his sis his little sister is not killing is humans. He's a demon. And they all know this, so they're like, okay, bring him in, because we want to know what it is. And that's what leads us to the last five episodes of the season. And when we saw the end shot was the Avengers in Demon Slayer. Basically. World. They look yeah. good. So we're going to go watch the <laughs> last five. Yes. We'll come back, and then we'll let you know what you think of those. So, as always, like, comment, subscribe if you like what we're doing around here, and we'll catch you on the next video.